Christ, young man. Your generation doesn't hold a copyright on moral depravity, you know. <laughs> Sin has been on the prowl in Hill Valley since the day it was founded. Wow, a speakeasy. That must have been wild. Is it true they used to drink gin out of slippers like my grandma said? Don't romanticize the past, young man. Prohibition was a time when gangsters ruled the town while honest citizens quaked in their beds. So where was it? That speakeasy that burned down, I mean. That was ages ago. If you're looking for bootleg hooch... No, I I'm just curious, that's all. I'm a, a student of history. Student of history? My Aunt Fanny! Yeah, you a generation of hooligans and slackers could give two ripe things about history. Miss Strickland? A video store! Huh? The speakeasy used to be hidden in plain sight down there in the town square. Right where that disgusting videotape rental store squats today. So the video store building must have gone up after the speakeasy burned down. The following year, as I recall. What's with all these newspapers? This is my personal archive. I've got every issue of the Hill Valley Telegraph ever published. Get out. Every single issue? From 1871 to the present. If it happened in Hill Valley, you'll find it in my stacks. I guess somewhere in these stacks there must be an article about the speakeasy burning down. Naturally. I probably wrote it myself. I was quite a reporter back in the day. Any idea what date that article came out? Well, obviously, the day after the speakeasy burned down. Doing some stargazing? No, I set my sights on the lower things. Is that... Chip Tannen! Get away from that hubcap before I call you! Don't let me keep you from your business. You there! Don't even think about tossing that Kleenex on the ground! I told you not to touch those! Marshal Strickland. My grandfather, gunned down by Mad Dog Tannen. Over a hundred years ago. That's not how I remember it. Oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Miss Pretty Whiskers is very particular about who handles her food. Mind if I take a look? Go ahead, dear. Rebuilt in February 1932. So the fire must have happened before then. But when? I need a date. Don't look at me. I'm far too old for you. Excuse me, Miss Strickland. Don't let me keep you from your business. That tea's never gonna boil. There's 
the whistle! Surely the water's boiling by now! Let's see. Ground broken on sight of former speakeasy, singer vanishes, Hill Valley Expo delights crowd, soup kitchen exposed. Here we go. Speakeasy arsonist slain. Legal procedure gave way to old-fashioned vengeance last night when a mob descended on the Hill Valley Police Station. The suspect in the speakeasy arson case, a drifter known as Carl Sagan, was pulled from his... Carl Sagan? It's Doc! Killed by a mob? What's the date? June 14th, 1931. Jeez, I gotta rescue him. My newspapers! Sorry, Miss Strickland. Uh, let me... No! You've gotten my history out of order! Oh, do you know how long it'll take to fix what you've done? Oh, get out! Get out! Get out! Help! Police! I'm being attacked by hooligans! Marty! Where you been, son? And what are you doing in that getup? Uh, didn't I tell you? I, I got the lead in the school play. Uh, we're doing... Grapes of Wrath? Right! Oh, Steinbeck! Who are you playing? Um, uh... Never mind, you don't have to explain. I'm sure whatever it is you're up to, you know what you're doing, right? I hope so. Hey, sometimes you gotta go out on a limb for the ones you love, right? Wish my dad had understood that. You won't stay away too long. You'll barely know I was gone. You ready to go, Einstein? Time circuits? On. Flux capacitor? Uh, fluxy. Time circuits are already on. I can't leave the DeLorean now. Doc's waiting for me in 1931. Okay, if Doc's gonna get killed on June 14th, 1931, I'll just show up the day before and get him out. I hope you know what you're doing, Doc.
Einstein, where'd you go now, boy? man excuse me young man who uh, me you're the only man in the street and I'm looking for a man in the street reaction naturally you know about the explosion that destroyed this illegal gin establishment I read about it yeah what's your opinion of Carl Sagan the stranger who single-handedly did what the law has been unable to do for ten long years namely rid Hill Valley of the scourge of liquor Uh. Doc get himself into... Doc? Doc is his nickname. I'm good friends with Carl. You are? Really? Oh, but I need an unbiased opinion for my story. Pretend you don't know him. How would you feel about his heroic act of destruction? Well, I'm not so big on bomb blasts. Yes, but this bomb blasted a speakeasy, the very symbol of lawlessness and corruption. You're all for cleaning up the town, aren't you? Do you have a message for the vicious gangsters who still roam these streets? No doubt plotting to corrupt our citizens with another den of booze, sin, and debauchery. Ask him where I can get the address. Ah, I see! Because you want to blast it to smithereens just like Carl Sagan did. With public-spirited citizens like you around, the lawless element will be on the run in no time. Mr. May I get your name? Yeah, it's... Michael... Corleone. Thank you for sharing your candid opinions, Mr. Corleone. Edna Strickland, Hill Valley Herald. I know. I met you back. I mean, I'm familiar with your work. You read my column? How sweet! I know it's just an etiquette column, but I believe it'll lead to bigger and better... Oh! Einstein, no! Down, boy! Is this wretched creature yours? He assaulted me once before. What's got into you? Aggressive dogs must be kept on leash at all times. It's the law. Look it up. Doc, I gotta find Doc. You gonna buy anything? Um, no. Then get out, Bob. 